first time being on this job that I'm witnessing something like that. This is unbelievable. And it's like a gang took over the whole countries, and they are even more than us as police officers. Explain to him I arrived from Canada yesterday, yeah. and all over the news internationally, all they're talking about is the gang war mm -hmm. right now in Port-au-Prince. They did in South Canada, yeah. Mm -hmm. Et puis, à tout à l'attendre, on a télévisé pour mettre de temps en temps. Et les plus durs, même pour moi, on fait au fort. Yo, mettez nous nos sandwichs en haut, tout côté cerclé. Oui, et ils disent, like, the gang kind of sandwich the police officers. They put them in the middle. It's everywhere, he said, he says, it's all over the country. And they, they are, as police officers, they seem to be in the middle of all of this. What is going to be the solution to the problem? Is it time or? Et qui ça on va le penser là qui va solution problème ça. Vous dans l'eau passer dans rage. Oui. Qui ça veut dire? He said the only solution right now is the authorities of this country to take this problem at hand. And also he believe that the international community can help as well. And they should try a way to help us because they can. Because he feels that the gangs have a connection with the authorities. Because they feel too them comfortable. And they come from all the way from the south part in Kafu and come and kidnap people up in Petronville. Right. He said they, they feel uh, they feel too comfortable. It's like they are in some connections with the, uh, uh, the, 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 the authorities themselves. Now with the kidnappings, it's gang kidnapping gangs or gangs kid, kidnapping regular people? Jean Boss, no problem kidnapping. Is it gang kidnapping gang or gang kidnapping people? Gang kidnapping gang, no? Gang kidnapping people. There's a situation. These are gang kidnapping gangs. They are kidnapping uh, entrepreneurs, people who are trying to make a living. So the biggest problem here is with the crime is kidnapping and gangs. Qui donc plus gros problème là qui existe qu'on y a là, c'est problème kidnapping et puis gang là. Gang là, c'est ça, ça insécurité, un problème insécurité total. Yeah. Génie total du capital, insécurité. He says the country is not working well. Um, it's uh, it's a, a total insecurity that uh, we are living in in Haiti. He says that and, and that also causes um, uh, hunger and uh, 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 a lot of problems are happening. It's not, the country is not working well at all. Yeah. He said, they say it is actually them, the politicians, who is creating these problems. Right. They're creating fear and they are getting prepared for elections. So at this moment, nothing is going to happen really until someone becomes uh, in power. And, and when is that going to happen? Uh, is there a date scheduled for the election? There is no date scheduled. Par contre, that qui fixe pour l'élection là. Don't you know about that? Même moment ça là. He says when you are, that's what the, our president was trying to do, that this problem doesn't reach at this level. This gang problem, this insecurity problem doesn't reach up to this level. And um, it's just like, uh, what is going to happen in this country? It's like, um, they all are being prepared for uh, elections. And uh, this interim government that is now in place, uh, they can be here for one, two, three years. They don't have a time of enter, they don't have a time of living. Okay. Uh, uh, what is happening is that all they're doing is that corruption, stealing the government money. And that's all what's happening right now. Now with this squad here, what is their responsibility? Yeah. He said their jobs is uh, we get of a, a, a prevention, preventing that anything uh, uh, like the bandy would try to kidnap someone. What they do is find a way and tackle those uh, uh, gang members. And um, he also said that uh, uh, they don't have better guns than the uh, uh, the gang members. They have better guns than them, and they also have more ammunition than the police officers. So he says that we are trying our very best to tackle them down. But let's say about four of us with our little guns and yep. they have bigger guns than us and they have more ammunition, ammunition than us. I mean, how are we going to fight these guys? But we are trying our very best to tackle them because we are police officers. We can't bow down in front of gang members. And the people in general respect the police here? 
Munyo respect you, but away from police. I have to tell you is those be, the older people and those people who doesn't carry guns are the people who respect us. Uh, but the Bendy have no respect for us. They shoot at us at all time, every time. You are less than you are less. But you are less. They do not fear. They do not fear. They have no fear at all. They all relax and they feel great in what they're doing. This so, I mean, is the first time that he sees something like that. Yeah. Like gang members will be so be so comfortable and doing what they're doing. So it's dangerous to be a police officer in the capital right now. Uh, yeah, they have to fight every day. They are fighting with gang members every day, and there are gang members that are trying to take the police stations and uh, an area in the east called Penye, and they have to fight them every time, at all time. And they're kidnapping people, and they have to keep uh, trying to fight them at all, at all costs. In Toronto, where I'm from, I know a police officer. He's been a police officer 25 years. Mm -hmm. Never once has he pulled his gun out of his holster. So, I mean, how often does it happen where he's actually in a in a gunfight. Mais chaque kill est ça obligé de river que chaque jour à chaque jour dans mon main. Pas conjuma dans mon main. Chaque jour en ground shooting. Chaque jour every day. And some officers that he knows have been shot. Et au pas gain aucun euh euh camarade qui qui tombe si je victime mourir oui. Plusieurs fois. He said that all time. Plusieurs fois, plusieurs fois. A lot of them victims and killed sometimes. Oui, qui vont pas qui l'hôpital qui some of them in the hospital and some of them died. So what motivates him to wake up every morning and put the outfit on? Trying to protect our country. And we are nationalists, we love our country, we're protecting our country. Mm -hmm. They are Haitians. Right. It's us. Right. I said the gangs, the answer is that. They helped assassinate the president and they didn't receive any money at all. And now they're gonna find their own way to make their own money. Now they have arrested a few people, Colombians I saw, for killing the yeah. president. You are ready to get Colombian. Why why would Colombians be here to kill a president? What is the motive? As uh, what he was informed, it was not the Colombians who assassinated the president. It is us. Because uh, what he informed is that once uh, the Colombians arrive, they find out that the president was already dead. Right. So it is us. It's our problem. And we have to take our responsibilities. I appreciate him being very honest with me. It means it means a lot. He said, "This is that what is happening in the country hurt him very bad as well." He says, "Him as a police officer, this is not his mission to keep fighting like that with all those big guns." He said, "This is the missions of an army." And now I'm, I go. He said he, he go beyond his own works now to keep uh, uh, using those big guns. That this is something he didn't learn in the academy right. as a police officer. No, he says gangs are everywhere in Port-au-Prince, some part of the north, and some in Capetian, uh, but mostly in the Port-au-Prince area in Carrefour. They try to come up here in Petronville. They, they will come and just kidnap one or two people, but they can't stay here because we won't allow them here. Mm -hmm. They can't stay in, uh, in Pitchernville. Yeah, it's starting from babies to all the people. So, tout monde. Because once they're starting to shoot around, yeah, they're shooting. And they're shooting, and then they're using machete to chop up people even. Now, since he's been on the job a long time, emotionally, how... What is the like when he sees a dead body? Is, is it still difficult, or it's become every day? Yeah. Comme vous savez, on a job ça en bon temps. Émotionnellement, à bousouf. 
Abusov. He's tired. Yeah. Abusov. Abusov. It's your people, right? It must be very difficult to continually see death. David, you see, when we are in the joint area, the Munda faction is here. Yo, 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 say I see. I see. You are stranger. You never have a day off. It's like every day you have to keep working. Yeah. Never have. He should have his day off, but he can't have no days off. What does he do in his off time? It's been two years since he haven't traveled, so he that's what he does. He's just travel. Mm -hmm. But he's been two years since he can't even travel because he's working every day and every day. They don't even give him days off. We have hope. We have hope in the future. Things are going to become better. Uh, he said the only thing that would happen here is hope is that um, the uh, international community should come and bring us uh, their support. Mm -hmm. And uh, the same thing that they did in 2004 after Arisid left the country, mm -hmm. when the UN came in, uh, and supported Haiti against uh, 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 the killing in Cité Soleil and all of the gang activities that was happening. <laughs> I think we're getting back. They call them in base. What about the police? Uh, do they get ambushed? Like, for example, we're in a car right now. Yeah. Do they ever get shot at just for driving around? Uh, he said, God and, uh, and heaven and uh, the other spirits that you can see yeah. help us, help him uh, uh, um, survive the attacks. But this is something that happens very, very often. There is no way there will be elections with all those guns on the streets. Yeah. There is no way. The only way that there will be an uh, election, the international, uh, commu uh, international uh, community would have to come and support us.